hello guys what's up it's your girl sewa on trading news thank you for subscribing to my youtube channel mm. so now let's move on to today's episode actress fuke akindele Bello, aka jennifer was arrested for celebrating husband's birthday party with guarding more than 20 people at our house at amen estate lagos so let's see the video from the party <laughs> This is the best estate to be stuck in in the lockdown. It's my birthday. husband JJC shared the video of the party on his Easter story followers started talking about them they are not practicing what they preach this made Fika Kidele Belu aka Jennifer to come up to clear herself let's listen to what she said hello everyone my name is Funke Akindele Belu an actress uh, one of the CEOs of same one production um, I've seen all the messages on social media and I must say, I will not intentionally mislead people, which is why I want to explain what happened yesterday. Truly, yesterday was my husband's birthday, and both of us run Sing One Studios, which is located in MN Estate, where we live. We have studios running to like 12 in there. We have interior, exterior. We build sets there. We build road, market. That's where we film Jennifer's Diary, all our content. A little old town and the rest. So before the pandemic, coronavirus pandemic, we all work together here. We have a strength of um, 100 workers, but not all 100 are here now. So this is where everybody work and we shoot a lot of content. So when the pandemic started, we had to stop all production, including Omogeto the Saga, which is our new project, which was supposed to start April. But before the lockdown was announced by our president, some youths have been in boot camp here in Imen Estate, rehearsing, singing, dancing. Majority of the youths are those you saw in the video. So when the lockdown was announced, some of the staff, not all of them, live outside Lagos. And they can't go back. But still, she was still taken to magistrate court in Ogba where she pleaded guilty. She was asked to pay a fine of 100,000 naira and also she and her husband are uh, asked to do community service for 14 days for 3 hours per day. So moving on to next, COVID emergency food relief package in Lagos, Nigeria. See the video. <laughs> By the way, I came across a video of a man complaining about the package given to him and his eight children. Let's see the video. Out of this COVID-19 emergency food response, please. This is not the solution. This is not the solution. Let them find another way out. Please, you cannot keep a family man with his children. Let's say we have, like me now, I have about eight children. Now you give me this kind of rice to eat with my children. What can I, why can I come to court? I don't have anything to do. Apart from when I go out, I find what to eat. Now they are telling me that this has about eight children. Now you give me this kind of rice to eat with my children. What can I, why can I come to court? I don't have anything to do. 
Apart from when I go out, I find what to eat. Now they are telling me that this is a rice that I should stay home with my eight children, two wives. That is making the population of a local family. Now to eat with the say, oh, right, please, let the government... Okay, the food distribution in other parts of the world, let's see how that is done. Yeah, can you see? This is a country. This is what we call food distribution. It was distributed at everybody's doorstep. You know, this is what we call food distribution at a social distance. We don't want to. I don't even know who dropped it here, but we have. We have. Um, what we did was um, to have um, notify them through the through the social internet that we need food. And what do you do? Do ask for your address. Do ask for your um, your, the, your apartment number. And that is it. They will bring. They will ask you how many families that will last. What they will bring for you. What will last you at least for a week. You can see here. They have brought milk. They have brought everything is here. They have brought. They have brought egg. They have brought all manners of things. All manners of things have been brought for the children. They have brought all the countries for eating. All they have brought every lot. A lot of things have been brought. For this. this is what we call food bag. A lot of things have been brought. We brought in, uh, noodles. What have you? Even up to bread. Even they even brought. See, they even brought the pepper. They brought the carrot. You see, they brought all manners of things. They brought all manners of things. These are what 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 we call country that respect people. You see, they brought all manners of things. All manners of what I feel. I didn't give them a time. I didn't know who brought it, but I know it's, it's from the food bank. This is what I said they should be doing. We should be doing in Nigeria for our people. Now, taking them to the market square, endangering their lives. When are we going to get to this level in Nigeria? Thank you. Okay, please, I want you to drop your thoughts, your, your experience on this in the comment section. Let's know how it is. Or maybe this could be or what got to him i don't know but you know so the package might be different or maybe his own package has been tampered with i don't really know much but i want you people to drop your own opinion your experience in the comment section so when this was going on this is what a Ghana brother made to help in reducing the spread of covid19 in his country let's see the video if you store solar system that will help pump the water and we have sensors so we don't need to touch the tap it drinks the soap first and the water follows so i'm demonstrate for you to see how it is done so here's the sensor so as the one produces the sensor the soap comes so this is the soap the soapy water We've programmed it for 25 seconds, so you'll be able to wash your hand very well. You see? So you wash your hand very, very well. And we've given you an alarm system. That will prompt you that the system is still working. As soon as the alarm goes off, the water flows. Yeah. So this is how it is done. So the water comes and you wash your hand very well. So, so we've given you two in one. The same system carries the soapy water to the same cup and the same system also gives you the ordinary water to wash off the soapy water. 25 seconds. This is a system that we created to help solve the COVID-19. Imagine we have this on all our streets with the Ghana flag on it. Very attractive. People will be attracted to wash their hand. The best way of solving this pandemic is washing your hands very well. So this is what we Wow. Close to him, bro. And there are some pictures of what 
an assembly member representing his constituency did to reduce the spread of COVID-19 in his constituency. But my question now is that by people touching the edge of this tap water, won't people get infected? Won't this virus spread the more? You know, but I don't really know much. I think you people will have your own opinion, your own experience on this. Drop your comments in the comment section and let's know what you feel concerning this. Thank you. But I don't want to say anything. I'm not talking. So good news to all Nigerians in abroad. The Nigerian government is ready to evacuate you back to Nigeria anywhere you are in the world. Just go to the nearest Nigeria embassy and put down your name so that the Nigerian government will evacuate you back to Nigeria. Because the minister said for now Nigeria is still safe for you to come back to that Nigeria is still safe. The cases of coronavirus is under control, like unlike other countries. So go and do the necessary trip put down your name so that you can be evacuated back to Nigeria. all right thank you that will be all for today thank you and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel amazmi network tv follow me on my social media page facebook instagram twitter at saiwa underscore koshred and also like and share my post give it a thumbs up at the end of the video bye